Good morning. We want to move into our uh, time of prayer for the city this morning. Remember, it's a corporate time of, of prayer. It's not for me just to stand up here and pray for the city, but it's a time for you to join with me. <clears throat> we call it harp and bowl, which means there'll be music. So Chris will be playing the music, and that's the harp. And we're, we're the bowl. We uh, speak the prayers. And Chris will sometimes get a chorus on what we're praying, and we'll sing that together. And that's the same as praying. It's all prayer. Does that make sense? In the, in the Bible, it says that we're to sing songs, speak spiritual songs and hymns together. So, Lord, we just want to open up this time this morning, and we just want to pray for our city. <clears throat> we believe that you have spoken words over this city that this would be a place where people would say the Lord is here. And so, Lord, we just ask you to bring revival to our city. And God, when we're asking for revival, we're asking you to revive your bride. We're not talking about the lost. We're asking you to revive us as believers. Bring back life to our hearts where there's death. Bring back that first love. God, we ask you, <clears throat> that out of 2 Chronicles 7, 14, that we are your people, that we would humble ourselves and pray, and that we would seek your face, and that we would turn from our wicked ways, and then believing as we do our part, you do your part. You hear our prayers, and you heal the land. God, it's not just the people of the land, but it's the land. And there would be evidence of revival. So God, we ask you to come and do what only you can do in our city. We say, open up the gates and let the King of glory come into our city, come into every congregation, even those who are meeting now, those who are about to meet. God, we ask you, King of glory, come into our city in Jesus' name. Lord. 
sing this to pray us as we join together corporately to believe for our city. That is our corporate cry to the Lord, and it's just the same as singing our prayers. So as we join together in those choruses, it's a powerful aroma that rises to the Lord. Father, we cry out to God that as we gather as a city, O oh God, in different locations, O oh God, we cry for an outpouring of your spirit today. For you say in the last days you will pour out of your spirit upon all flesh. Lord God, it's a new month, Lord God. We cry out, O oh God, for an outpouring, O oh God, of revelation knowledge. In the name of Jesus, pour it out on our children, on our youth, on the young adult. In the name of Jesus Christ, we thank you, O oh God, that this being the third month of the year, O oh God. Lord, we ask, O oh God, according to your word in the book of Hosea, you say after two days you will revive us, and in the third day you will raise us up. Let there be a raising up, O oh God, all over the city, that you will raise up the downcast, O oh God. Lord God, those who have no hope, you will give hope. Lord God, those who are in despair, O oh God, you will bring hope in the name of Jesus, for you are the hope of the nation. Those who are no, have no peace, you will bring your peace, O oh God. Lord, lift up your banner, O oh God. We lift up the banner of Jesus all over the city this morning, O oh God. In the name of Jesus, Lord God, that the banner of Jesus, the bloodstained banner of Jesus, we fly over the city. In the name of Jesus Christ, we receive victory. Victory for every man, every woman, every boy, and every girl today in Jesus name thank you Jesus the book of Zechariah 1 3 says therefore tell the people this is what the Lord Almighty says return to me declares the Lord Almighty and I'll return to you says the Lord Almighty father in the mighty name of Jesus Father, Lord, we just declare this morning as a city, we stand in agreement, Father, Lord. Father, Lord, that we will return to you, Lord God. We will return to our first love. Father, Lord, we just ask for your presence in our city in the mighty name of Jesus. Father, Lord, we declare your peace upon the city. We declare your presence. We declare your power. We declare your will upon the city in the mighty name of Jesus. Father, Lord, that you will put the people through the refiner's fire, Lord God. Father, Lord, that you will purify us. You will refine us, Lord God. Father, Lord, that we will focus on you. We will focus on things that concerns you, Lord God. Father, Lord, we are sick and tired of being sick and tired. We are tired of playing religion, Lord God. Father, Lord, we are tired of setting our own agendas, Lord God. Father, Lord, we just cast all our cares all our worries father lord we cast it before you and father lord we ask that you take control lord god father lord that you will take control father lord we come against the spirit of immorality in our city in our nation lord god 
Father Lord, we cause and we pray for a change, Lord God. Father Lord, we pray for a change. Father Lord, we ask that you shake every negative foundation in our city, Lord God. Father Lord, everything that is not of you, Father Lord, that you will shake it. Father Lord, that you begin to turn things around in the mighty name of Jesus. Thank you, Heavenly Father, in Jesus' name. So I'm just getting a chorus in my head, so I'm going to sing it, and we're all going to sing it together. And we're going to close this time on agreeing that the Lord wants to revive us. So Chris, if you'll just keep playing that, what you were playing, we're going to sing this together. And it's just very simple. Revive us, revive us, revive us, Lord, we pray. Here we go. Revive us, revive us, revive us, we pray. Revive, revive us, revive us, revive us, we pray.
covered by your mercies. Sing that again. On and on and on and on it goes. One more time. On and on and on and on it goes. Oh, yes, we say on and on and on and on it goes. Your love, it covers us. Your love, it covers us. Your love empowers us. Your love empowers us. Your love sets us free. See, we are free indeed. Your love, it sets us free. We are free indeed. Your love, your love never fails and never gives up. It never runs out. dry. We thank you that your word says, come all you who are thirsty, come to the waters, and you who have no money, come buy and eat. Come buy wine and milk without money and without cost. Why spend money on what is not bread and your labor on what does not satisfy? Listen, listen to me and eat what is good and you will delight in the richest of fare. Give ear and come to me. Listen that you may live. I will make an everlasting covenant with you, my faithful love promised to David. Father God, I pray that we would have eyes to see you and what you're doing in our lives and ears to hear all that you would say to us. God, that we would be the voice that you've called us to be to the nations, to the city, to every area that you have our hands touched, God. 
We just pray for an overflow of your presence, God. We welcome you. We open up the gates of our hearts for your love and your glory to flow in.
Yeah. 